Today we're presenting the universe of Jeff and G through a um, musical short, presenting all of the aspects of the life of the characters of Jeff and G that we're going to be playing in the series. We had a very short prep time for this, and uh, the fact that we're here now, ready to shoot, is extremely exciting and extremely rewarding on its own. It's actually really more difficult than it looked like. <laughs> we say, oh, it's easy to sing and dancing, dance and the same thing. But you need to have a brain on your movement and at the same time say not all the song, but the word you do normally in the song because we sing, you know, GF make some part and I do some other part. So it was a beautiful challenge. And uh, Tracy did for Je Vois La Vie something, you know, really different because we talk about not just doing choreography like music video. Uh, our wish was to have movement all the time and have choreography so because we can walk but we can walk with a choreography and she did an amazing job completely different of what we did before by the past with the choreography and uh, I'm really impressed she really understand the vision of what we need for the next episode and the future in the series and the musical yeah. I realized that I could bring more to the table in a certain way. Setting up choreography in a specific way or setting it up for specific shots. I think bringing more specificity to the table is really helpful on this, in this sort of process. I think that what really helped me was the fact that I decided from the very start that I was not going to force and put pressure on myself to be uh, a precise dancer, which would take years, but just be the, my character, uh, just be myself. We have intricate lighting setups where within the same shot we're going from night to day and changing not just one light but, you know, 15, 20 lights at the same time. Um, so that's going to be um, probably the most challenging thing. That plus choreography added and camera movement. But I think it's great to have a challenge and push ourselves. That's the only way that uh, something really good happens. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. Uh, I'm very thankful for JFNG you know, giving me that opportunity. April did such an amazing job um, for the design of the scene because it was, you know, short notice and it's, you know, unbelievable. The dancing from what we call the Lake Como scene, if you look at the detail of each dancer, what they're doing, what Geneviève is doing, what the other dancers are doing, it's, it's a very high level uh, dance and choreography and everything from the lighting to the costumes to, uh, you know, everything that was part of that scene is very satisfying for me. Bye. It was the first time I really, you know, hacked in, in English. Um, in front of people in a big sound stage, and uh, the first time we act together, me and GF, you know, we, we are a couple in life, and now we are a couple on screen. For me, what's fascinating about looking at Geneviève act, first of all, she's acting in a foreign language, which is, you know, one thing on its own, and the natural that she brings to it, that's what fascinates me. I see her doing moves with her hands and stuff that she does and things that she acts. It looks like she's done this all her life, you know. Vikan did perfectly. It was, you understand, all the vision, every scene was clear. Um, the light was perfect. The result was amazing and uh, the guy for Ellen was good as well. So it was a really, really, really absolutely success, a team success, I think. JF and G are super easy to work with. They seem to like any ideas that you bring to the table and 
The team that they're putting together I think is exciting. Move it, move it, move it. We were able to get things moving very quickly um, and do 12 setups within only two days, uh, which is pretty amazing when you think of it and the complexity of each setup. The Foley world is a fascinating world and it's a mysterious world. Certain things that they use to do certain sounds, you would never imagine that that's what it was. The best part was when um, the woman at the fall session tried to reproduce the step of the dancer. So they actually need to dance a little bit or just reproduce the, the same sound and it was really, really fun. It's been a really lovely um, set, lots of intelligence um, and also a lot of creative direction. So that's very helpful when you're working um, in a collaborative effort to have people who are great communicators. For me, I like the opening scene and maybe that's just from a, from a Foley perspective. Um, I liked it because it, you start with a little prop, you follow it, you take the story, you do the footsteps, you go into the next scene and you sort of establish the sound. It was our best moment to test the vision that we had and, um, and it was a great success. And I think with the Wallaby well, come see everybody in step up, you know, a level. And I think more we will work together and more we will be a strong, strong team, like, you know, and we will do something amazing and probably history. <laughs> So welcome into the world of JF and G, and we hope you will enjoy Je vois la vie comme si. <laughs>